Okay, so make no mistake about it, the upcoming battle involving Budo and Ultra Instinct Goku within my Dragon Ball Super fan manga is really going to be off the chain, and today, I'm gonna go on ahead and give you guys just a little bit of a preview as to what is to be expected in this upcoming battle involving the two. Now, as of course you guys are seeing right now, I'm trying my best to see if I can actually get the better of Goku, and in order to give you guys a little bit of a preview, as of course you guys can see right over here on your screen, the battle involving Budo and Goku whenever it goes down is going to heavily favor Budo because Budo is going to be using shape-shifting abilities. He knows mostly a lot about Goku's history and his past, and given the fact that Budo has the ability to basically shape-shift into anything, including Goku, that's exactly what he's going to do, and Budo is going to use the metamorphosis idea of combining essentially Goku's enemies from the past into one. Without giving too much away, Goku is in fact actually going to be fighting against very keen and specific specific fusions that a lot of you guys may have seen on the channel before. So the goal would essentially be for Goku to overcome this obstacle as of course Budo is primarily looking to kind of torture Goku first instead of just having to get the job done right off the bat. But as the fight with Budo inevitably ends up continuing, then there's going to be a little bit of a surprise that I'm not going to give away right now, but something is going to go down that actually forces Goku in transcending even further in discovering the power that he originally wanted to discover. So, if you just so have happened to have missed out on the previous episodes, oh, we just got rid of him. Easy. That was actually a really really easy fight so if you guys missed out on the previous episodes you guys can go on ahead and find them located down in the description box below and pinned comment section because right now we're gonna go on ahead and run that back because there is much much more for us to talk about so here's the thing as well so a lot of you guys may be wondering well are we going to see the other warriors fight goku well to that extent i will say yes and no because something is going to happen within the story that's going to cause a drastic change to occur, which kind of puts certain things into perspective, especially with the Grand Priest having to later make his decision on what he wants to do. And I love the fact that my aura right now is just, okay, Goku, Goku thinks that he got it. Now, here's the thing as well. So in terms of strength, Goku is not going to be able to compete with Budo to that extent because Goku will in fact be weaker. However, when it comes down to agility, when it comes down to speed, and it comes down to basic intellect when surrounding the circumstance of who might get the better of who in this fight, then Goku is going to be able to hang in there. Wow, we got rid of him via multiple death beams to the chin. Now, we're definitely going to run that back one more time because I was just about to get into something important that I think you guys might want to hear about. So as I was saying, Goku will in fact be able to be fast enough to avoid danger. He will be actually fast enough to basically avoid whatever it is that Budo might be throwing at him, but at the same time, Budo is going to display crazy amounts of feats that Goku is simply going to be overwhelmed by. But let's not forget, Goku in fact actually has three lifelines, he has three perks, which he will end up using, but I'm just not going to tell you when. So again, if you guys want to get sneak peeks and exclusive first looks as to this story and many others, then again, visit my Patreon, support us on Patreon, patreon.com slash gaming. link to that will also be located down below as well, on there you guys will get all my soundtracks, all of the mods, all of the fan mangas, all that kind of stuff, so I would say it's worth it, and it does go on to help us out a lot by producing and getting these mangas done quicker, and I'm looking to actually finish this, because not for nothing, there is going to be something that I'm going to reveal later on that, you know, is going to benefit Go Oh, we just, yo, we just tanked right through that Kamehameha, which not for nothing, you're going to see. I, I'm just not going to kind of elaborate as to how it's done. Yeah, Goku lost all three of those rounds, dude. Budo is just too strong in this game, and it's just crazy. So with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I hope you guys are ready for what we have coming on the main channel. If you guys are new, hit that subscribe button, everybody. Give this video a big fat thumbs up right now. Tune back in for more, and I'll be seeing you all down in the comment section below and in the next video. Take it easy, guys, and have a great day. Peace.